We've got an update on a shooting involving a Dallas officer over the weekend. Today, DPD released body camera video of that incident. Senior crime and justice reporter Rebecca Lopez joins us now with a look at that video. Rebecca, uh, what, what can you show us here? Well, Dallas Police Chief Eddie Garcia says the video shows the dangers officers face on the streets. The suspect in this case is a convicted felon that was already on probation on a weapons and drug charges. He was and he was on an ankle monitor that Garcia says he cut off in August. The video you are about to see is graphic and shows what happened when officers Matthew McLean and Kimberly Esquivel encountered him. Man, put your hands up. Man, what the hell? Who? No. <laughs> Get him, Kimberly! Hurry up! This guy's got a gun! Gun! Dallas police say the officers were responding to a call from uh, an apartment complex where they believe there was a suspect who had stolen a vehicle recently. Officers were responding to that call when they spotted Hernan Gutierrez. When they tried to take him into custody, police say he resisted, pulled out a weapon, and fired a shot at officers. Officer Esquivel fired her weapon, shooting uh, Gutierrez. Chief Garcia said his officers narrowly escaped being shot. We'll have more on this coming up. Oh. The decision Officer Esquivel made in the face of evil saved lives on Sunday. She saved the life of her partner, her own, and protected those we swore to serve who were simply going about their day at home. Police say Gutierrez is in the hospital in critical condition. He has a lengthy criminal history, including two kidnapping convictions, drug charges, and DWIs. When he was arrested, there was an active warrant for his arrest. The officers were not injured. Back to you. All right, Rebecca, thank you uh, for bringing us that new development here this afternoon.